So today we're going to explore the salt flats of Oklahoma. We start off at the Salt Flats National State Park Spillway and I do a little bit of fishing and then we head to the Salt Flats. And then just hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and leave a comment. Thank you guys so much for watching. Look at all the birds go. Look at this spillway. Look at how dried up it is. So guys, I've just climbed up this ladder. Look at this ladder up the spillway. Okay guys, from the salt flats, I got like a perfect cluster. This one right here, I found the biggest one. This one right here is fat. St. Plains National. Yeah, this is so pretty. Look, so the lake, salt crystal stuff is all the way out there. Oh my God. So there's the lake out there. Y'all are about to get a really good view of it. This lake is way bigger than I thought. We're about to go fish the spillway too. Oh shoot, here's the spillway. We are coming up to the spillway right now. We're at the top of it. Uh oh. Guys, so we are on the other side of the salt flats. We're over here at the spillway area right now and I'm about to actually get a pole in the water. Let's go get a closer look at this. The salt flats are over there on the complete other side of it. There's literally nobody here. Y'all have already probably seen it from the intro. Dude, this looks like a good spot to fish. So the crystal digging area, the salt flats, are all the way over there. Look at all the birds go. Look at this spillway. Look at how dried up it is. It's so dry. The river is so dry. Dude, I'm about to go down there and cast a pole. Oh my mama. Look at this duck right here. Guys, so I'm right here casting out. We're about to walk over to there. It looks like it drops off. Okay, guys, so here in a minute, I'm going to walk out to that. And I'm going to cast. See if we can get a fish. I really want to see if I can hold that duck. Huh? So I really want to see if I can hold that duck. Hey, you can stop recording, please. Okay, guys, so I'm walking over here. I'm about to go cast off of this. Dude, look at this spillway right now. We're in Alfalfa County, Enid, I believe. There's a ton of shad jumping. I want to get over this and see if I can look over it, but... So guys, I've just climbed up this ladder. Look at this. The ladder up the spillway. <laughs> Got my sister over there. She's gonna come take a look. So dude, you know what I might do? Since I have my pole right here, I might actually give it a cast over there. Just for the heck of it. Maybe just one time. But uh, yeah, so look at this guys, we're here. Great Salt Plains Dam, we're about to go over this bridge right here. Oh, whoa, and a dent. Great Salt Plains Reservoir, Great Salt Plains Dam. And then you come over here, and a wowzer. Whew. And we got the Great Salt Plains over there. About to go to that right after this. We just had to come cast in here. I even cast it off in there. But yeah, we're gonna go down here. Oh, we got like a staircase. Whoa, this is cool. Still at the Arkansas River. Yeah, it does look salty. United States Army Corps of Engineers, Tulsa District, 1938. Government property. Guarantee you that thing goes down here into the spillway inside of it. Drive out there on it. Let's go, Patty. Let's go, Patty. <laughs> it's a 
scissor tail, baby. Dig area is one mile up ahead. Dig area one mile up ahead. Dude, it looks like an, it does look like an ocean. Oh, dig area one mile. Muddy road, just at your own risk. Oh my god, this is gonna be so much fun. We can't dig right here, we have to go, we have to go through here if we wanna dig. Oh my goodness, Jesse, are you excited? I'm pumped. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, baby, we're the dried up. <laughs> we have made it. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go out here and we're gonna go digging for the crystals. We're gonna let y'all know what we find. Here, this place is absolutely massive. We're gonna see what we can find. Alright, so check this out right here. Look at this, what I found. There's literally water down in here. Look at all these crystals. Look at Check this out. I found an even bigger water hole here in the salt flats. I'm gonna look around here for some crystals. Look at this team. Hey guys, so look at this. this is what my grandma's gotten of the selenite crystals, pretty sure. And this is what I've gotten. I've gotten some good pieces. I'm going to show y'all them after they're cleaned off. I've got some big pieces here. And then, this is what my sister's been doing. She's been digging a hole and look at all these ones she's got. Look at all of those. Some beauties in there. Some really cool looking ones. Really cool. This place is really cool. And if you dig about a foot or two down, you hit water. Which is really cool. Wow. Dude, that's a fresh one right there. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh yeah, it is. Oh, look at this big one. Oh yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. You know it. Look at this. Look at how pretty it looks out there. We're not allowed to walk on this part, but it's still really pretty out there. What happened? Found an absolute beauty. Let's see, where's the sun? Look at this. Absolute huge one. And it's it's like glass smooth and glass sharp on one side almost. Got the dig area over here. This is beautiful. It's so huge. We've got the lake over there. That's where the spillway is. That way was at. Alright, look at this. It looks like we're in the freaking desert right now. pasture and then you come over here and then it's just salt flats baby come out here dig for crystals selenite crystals just come look at the beauty of it come fish at the lake i don't think there's much fish in it though let's go over here and look at this little marker walk down this little trail oh i'm gonna go over here and walk on this thing see this little like pier thing looking up here Oh, there's a trail to it. There's a trail to get to it. No way. Guys, I'm going to this trail. Okay, guys, so this is what I've collected. Look at this. So this is from the salt flats. I got like a perfect cluster here. Look at this. Wow. Those are all crystals. The reason why they're not clear is because these ones have a, a, they're like completely filled with dirt. As you can see, dirt gets inside of them. But what it does is, 
it makes this thing called an hourglass and you can find this looks like an hourglass so that's one of the main things people find the dirt the crystal makes the dirt move out but it just does it perfectly because it's i don't know how it does it it's a naturally forming thing but we have this crystal cluster here i thought that one was very cool look at that and then this one is from gloss mountain the stuff that was literally paving the floors at gloss mountain and then this is a selenite gypsy also from gloss mountain that was a uh, like a donation thing that was just chilling outside and then yeah a lot of these some of these crystals are clear this one right here i found the biggest one this one right here is fat and it's like perfect too. look at that 